Uncle Hoosh's hat. Hey guys, welcome back to Harrison Hacks. Today I'm going to be showing you how to view and extract items from a Raspberry Pi image on your Windows PC. Uh, it's very easy to do. Uh, there's a small program and I will leave a link in the description. It's going to take you to this page. Uh, this is Disk Internals Linux Reader. Uh, it's free software and this will allow you to view um, Linux partitions or you can do uh, images as well you can load those up and extract the files from within so what you're going to want to do on uh, this page here is just click download and it'll start downloading you'll say thanks for trying and basically you just download install and run it so i've already downloaded it um, but once you have it downloaded you will have linux reader and we're going to want to install that So we'll just click next, I agree, install, and it shouldn't take too long at all. Now what's nice about this is if there's a Raspberry Pi image and there's something you want it, if you've got your own build on your Pi and you want to take something from someone else's and it's not publicly available other than in an image, uh, this works pretty well. There is an image, <clears throat> basically the reason why I do this, because you can extract images with 7-zip and things like that, but I've had an image where it just won't extract for me. Um, and, and that's how I found this program, and it's been working great for me uh, ever since. So we'll leave it checked, run Disk Internals Linux Reader, click Finish. And it's basically just loading up uh, any drives that it detects. So here's the drives on this computer of mine. <clears throat> what I want to do is go to drives, mount image, raw disk images, click next. And I have the Phil's Doodles Retro Rama image, uh, the first one that was done by Phil's Doodles. So I'm just going to click on that, click open. And now you can see here is the boot partition for the image, as well as the RetroPie uh, partition. So now we are in the image uh, within Windows. So for me, I really love the splash screen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Home, Pie. RetroPie, and here's BIOS files, RetroPie menu, uh, here's the ROMs, so we could go into ROMs, go into CPS1, here's all the ROMs in the game list, so on, I'm going to go back, because I want to go to splash screens, and there is the Retro Rama intro, an awesome intro, so I just clicked it there, here you can see a preview, it's actually playing in the bottom of the screen, I'm just going to pause it, and I will right click on the file and click save and we'll leave save files checked that's the only option we have and I don't save directory structure you could if you wanted to I uncheck this and I click browse and I'm just gonna go to desktop okay next and any files that you have here you can check or uncheck them click next And it's done. So I'll click finish, close the program, yes, and there it is. So it's a pretty awesome little program. Um, again, this is made by Disk Internals, uh, Disk Internals Linux Reader. I'll leave a link in the description. Uh, hopefully this helps people out. Hopefully uh, it's a useful tool for anyone wanting to extract certain parts of a Raspberry Pi image or extract a whole image and kind of um, learn learn the ins and outs of, of a Raspberry Pi image, which I'm currently doing at the moment. 
Uh, again, guys, really appreciate you watching. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and most importantly, have a good day.